Gatsby, it's for you. Oh, I guess they hung up. Oh my gosh, Gatsby, they're calling again! Here, here, answer the phone. Oh, they hung up again. I don't think they're gonna call us ever again, Gatsby. A big thank you to Cassandra Sijmajda. This was her video idea. Um, you can check out her original video in the description below. Other than that, it's time for us to start the vlog. You guys, it's that time of the year. It's shedding time. Look at all this. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is so much. I feel like I opened Pandora's box here. Now we just have to keep going. Let's just use this. The Furminator brush. We use this when he's shedding. You don't want to use this too much because it gets out like a lot of fur. But when they're shedding and you're trying to get rid of their coat, it's like the fastest and easiest one. <laughs> Corgis have two large sheds during the year, and this is one of them. They're getting rid of their winter coat. So, he has so much. Gotta get your butt. That's where all the fur comes off of. Look at all this fur here from coming off of Gatsby's mainly butt area. That was all on your butt. Oh, it looks so beautiful now. Check it out, it is all done. Gatsby's like, what? Oh, hello. It's nice to see you guys again. We've been taking a little bit of a break and I thought I would explain a little bit of why. Reason number one. I took my computer in to get fixed and it's still getting fixed. As you can see over here, no iMac. I just have a monitor here that's not connected to anything. I don't want to bore you too much with it, but basically my computer has been having problems for the past two years. I was waiting for the latest best iMacs to come out and the ones that came out are not really for video editing. What I decided to do is just get my computer fixed in the meantime. So I've been just waiting and waiting. It's been like over a week now. <laughs> anyway, I thought I would just start vlogging while I'm waiting for the computer to come. Sorry if the vlog is a little shorter, but that's what we have for right now. The next vlog should be a lot better when I get my computer back and it's all fixed and everything is back to normal. Reason number two, I got vaccinated. My second dose of the vaccine and the second dose definitely hit me pretty hard. I took a few days off to rest and recover. I feel way better now. Anyway, it's May. Ta-da! I cooked all the ingredients in the air fryer, and then I used shish kebab sticks, and I held every single piece of this up, and when we took the picture, Gatsby's like, what? It's time for us to play another ukulele song, Gatsby. In the comments below, let me know what song you think I'm playing. I like those corgi dogs in Georgia, corgi dog, my corgi dogs in California, corgi dog. Gatsby, are we gonna learn a new trick? <laughs> yeah, you wanna learn a new trick? So, today we are gonna be teaching Gatsby, who's seven years old, a new trick. 
I'm actually gonna eventually teach him two different tricks. Yeah, Gatsby? Oh, thank you. So I just brought Gatsby to the vet, and the vet was suggesting that Gatsby learn these two different tricks, which are really good for long spine dogs such as corgis, because it actually helps to strengthen and develop their core muscles, which is really important. I should have taught Gatsby these tricks a long time ago, and I actually thought that these were actually bad for their back, but apparently it's it's really good for them. Ready to learn? Okay. Pure beef liver bites. I have the link in the description for all the products that we use um, on Amazon. So in order to teach Sit Pretty, the dog already needs to know how to do sit. No higher. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. So once he does that, we need to get him to stay up in the up position. Guess he's like, I can do this. Okay. Good boy. That's called Sit Pretty, okay? Sit Pretty. Good boy. Sit Pretty. Good boy! After he learns sit pretty, we gotta teach him dance, which is the other one where they they go on their hind legs and they spin around. Sit pretty. Good boy! As long you have to hold it longer next time. Sit pretty. Sit pretty. Good boy! Sit pretty. Good boy, you're so cute. It'll be in our daily routine, which is to get Gatsby to do some sit pretties. So you develop your core muscles. Gatsby, the end product of sit pretty should be like this. <laughs> It is time for me to hit the gym. I am gonna do some shoulders today. I have been seeing some major gains. And really all I did was change up my diet. I'm wearing these super, super short shorts. It just goes with the outfit. So <laughs> I am gonna hit the gym now. See you guys there. So right now I'm headed off to Target. I have to grab a few things, including some stuff for Gatsby. So let's go. We haven't done a Target run in a while. Today's vlog is just gonna be really chill. We're just gonna do stuff that I usually do. Looking at Reese's Puffs or Little Yachty's Reese's Puffs. <laughs> What's the difference? It looks the same. The only difference I can see is one is family size and one is giant size. Wow, this looks old. Frosted flakes with marshmallows? Isn't this like sweet enough? That's just like sugar. <laughs> I haven't gone browsing inside of a Target in so long. Okay, I need witch hazel. There it is. So that said to get this for Gatsby. I'll try this too. Try the one. Why not? They even have Raya stuff. I haven't seen the movie yet. Have you guys seen it? Titanic the game. The jewel of the sea. There's a game called By Felicia. The only thing that they have of Black Widow is this. And it's on clearance. What is it? Is it a spoiler? USA all day. But not nighttime? No. Look how much Mandalorian stuff. Oh. oh. Got everything. It's time to head out. Is it time for us to go to the park? Jap, you can't ignore it. I'm transforming now. These cars and planes, I'm always boarding. Just out touring down in Charlotte, like I'm. We can try this witch hazel now. The vet said it's a lot stronger at getting the pollen off. Spray it onto a towel. Should we clean you? Okay, so for dinner today, I thought we would just make whatever we had in the refrigerator that's gonna go bad. My friend went to Trader Joe's and gave me a few things that are gonna go bad soon. So I have rockfish. So I thought that I would just make it in the air fryer. It's able to cook the fish a lot more evenly and make the outsides really nice and crispy. Let's get started with our like super simple meal. The recipe calls for lemon pepper with the fish, which sounds pretty good. Just rinse off the fish, we're patting it dry. Just brush it with olive oil. Are you enjoying your dinner, Gatsby? <laughs> oh, that's slurping. Just like a... 
garlic powder, onion powder, some salt. And do the back side. We're gonna preheat our air fryer. I already sprayed cooking oil on top, so all we do now is we just stick the fish inside. 360 for around 6 to 12 minutes. In the meantime, we can work on this veggie mix. I think I'm just gonna fry it on the stove. This is broccoli, carrots, green cabbage, red cabbage, jicama, green bell pepper, and radish celery. Just like a tablespoon of water. Cover it and it'll cook in like a few seconds. The fish should be done. So you have to be able to flake it. Yeah, that's correct. That's done. That looks pretty good, right? Pretty good. Dinner in 10 minutes. The fish looks like it's really flaky, which is super nice. Mmm, it's cooked to perfection. That fit, oh, the air fryer cooks the fish so well. It's perfect. It's like melt in your mouth. Mmm, and I seasoned it really well. Vegetables. That vegetable has jicama and radishes in it, so it adds a little bit of a crunch when you bite into it. I seasoned it with a lot of salt and pepper. Mango tastes really good. I am happy with this meal. <laughs> I would personally give myself a score of an eight out of 10. I think it's like totally, this is good. It's healthy and it tastes delicious. Yes, oh yes. You get it? Oh my gosh! Oh. <laughs> oh. Okay, well it is time for us to head to bed already. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Also don't forget to check out our merchandise at corgionfleek.com. Other than that, we're gonna head to bed and hopefully I'll get my computer in very, very soon. Hopefully the telemarketers don't bother us anymore. Yeah, Gatsby? <laughs> Oh yes, okay. We'll see you guys in the next video. Good night. Hey Gatsby, check out this awesome fan. Okay, so in one of the comments in the last vlog, someone suggested I try that TikTok trend where I get ready and